Hey guys, Anus here and you're watching Experience with Anus. I hope you all are doing well today and making the most of your time. It's 30th of December today and just one day left in this year. So how are you preparing to say a goodbye to this year? I hope you all are preparing for the new year and to say a goodbye to this year as well. Well, it's sunny day today after two rainy days if you watched my video yesterday you could see that there was cloudy yesterday but it's sunny here and the temperature is plus 19 at this time so it's kind of good for me and uh, I am wishing you and I'm sending you warmth from India if you do not have such temperature at this time I'm sending you warmth I hope you are feeling the warmth as well okay if you are here for the first time and uh, you're watching my video for the first time let me introduce myself to you my name is Anus and I'm from India I make videos about vocabulary and English conversation and I'm here once again with a new video of the series 10 random images series and you will get 10 random images I give you 10 random images and I give you three seconds to guess every single image and after that I tell you the right name of the pic so I hope you will enjoy the video so without wasting our further moment let's jump into the video Okay friends, here is the first pig. Do you know how to call this fruit? I hope you guessed it. This is called a lychee. It's very sweet and it's found in many countries. And this fruit is found in my region on a huge level. And I love it. I love this fruit. All right, here is the next one. Do you know the name of this vegetable? I hope you guessed it. Actually, there are three names that I know of this vegetable. Well, in American English, it is called eggplant. On the other hand, in British English, it is called aubergine. In many countries, it's also called a brinjal and I also call it a brinjal in my country. Here is the next pig. Do you know the name of this animal? Well, this is a mongoose. And I hope you have seen these animals before. This is the pig of a mongoose which is very clever and very active as you can see the feature of this animal. This is a mongoose here is the next one do you know the name of this beautiful flower i hope you guessed it this is plumeria so this flower is called plumeria and it's available almost everywhere i guess and available in many colors as you can see here on the screen beautiful color combination this is the speciality of this flower all right it's time to go ahead and here is the next pick do you know the name of such pillows I hope you guessed it well such pillows are called bolsters actually here these are many so I am saying bolster but when it, it is single you will say bolster this is a bolster and in plural form you would say bolsters all right here is a bolster a beautiful bolster okay it's time to go ahead well how to call this is tough I hope you guessed it this is called a tweezer so this one is called tweezer 
I think you know or maybe uh, you recognized it but you don't know the name but now you got it this is a tweezer as you can see the job of this stuff all right here is a cooking utensil can you tell me the name I hope you guessed it this is called a whisk so this is called a whisk it's a cooking utensil and uh, and we use it to blend ingredients smooth and the process is called whisking or wisping I hope you got the process name and the stuff name let's jump to the next pick can you tell me the name of this stuff that you see I hope you guessed it well this is called a hack saw that we use to cut something generally hard things like iron as you can see here on the screen so this is a hack saw well tell me the name of this machine a small machine I hope you guessed it this is called a calculator and uh, most of among us have used it already so you can see calculator in different types and now digital calculators are also available okay can you tell me this one here brightening in front of you I hope you guessed it well to indicate one it's called a tooth and in plural form this these are called teeth hope you got it now look at the teeth okay can you tell me this Kai situation at this time I hope you guessed it well when you see such weather condition in the sky you say it is cloudy so here you can see dark clouds so this is the example of cloudy sky I hope you liked the video if you like the video please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for the new updates of my upcoming videos well i'll be happy to read your comments so don't forget to comment down below and please tell me that how many words were there those are new for you and also how many words were there those you know those you recognized but you don't know the name i'll be so happy to read all those comments so thank you so much for watching this video and i'll see you in the next video until take care of yourself and take care of your own as well. Bye-bye.